Tipped away by Morris. Two on one with Long. And Morris will take it himself. Trailer to a cunning Ellis who will lay it in. And a very good start tonight for Perry Ellis. But Dustin Hogue was right there. He didn't go after the ball. He waited for it to come to him. And another transition bucket for the Cyclones. Niang spinning too strong off the glass. Tip up and good by Hogue. Nader for three. He was 17 years old when he got the Lawrence. Niang at the other end. Cyclones back within one. Niang the drive. McKay and one. And he brings the Jayhawks back within two. Dijon Jones is having himself a hat. That's one thing he's really been learning. Morris with a drive and scoops it up and in with a left hand. And a terrific pass by Mason out to Graham. Long. Yes. Strong drive by Naz Long to give Iowa State a three-point lead heading into halftime. Corner. That's a, a, an isolation play they like to run. They're isolating him again in the post. John Jones had a big first half. Eight points, five rebounds. Niang knocks down the three. Losses to the Jayhawks. Look how quick Iowa State gets it up the court. And Morris will finish with a little English. Trailer cleared some space and then missed the layup. A good no call by the official because Hope fly. For three. Ellis has played very well in limited minutes tonight because of foul trouble. Hogue is wide open. I mean, wide open. That was not a forced error. That was unforced. Morris lobs it up, and McKay with a finish. Those floater passes. Kentucky does this a lot. Landon, Landon Lucas is drawn to try to block a shot, and it's just lobbed right up to the bucket to Jamil McKay. And Oubre finishing strong. And right back at you. How about that? Is there a big man in the country who runs the floor as well as Jamil McKay? Crowd wanted an over the back on Lucas, but the Cyclones have the ball, and it's a five on four, and it's McKay! They are just breaking out to the other end. Oubre dunks it, and then the immediate inbounds to the streaking McKay passing ahead. You work really hard to get a second chance opportunity and then give up a layup in transition and then push. It's really unbelievable this, how smart he is with the ball. And long coast to coast. Defense non-existent right now for Kansas. Hunter Nicholson is into the game for the first time for Kansas. Ellis into traffic and McKay got all of that. A chance for three at the other end. I think that was on Perry Ellis. And a great play by Monte Morris. First, breaking the pressure. George Niang breaking the pressure and passing it up court. And then Morris just going right into Perry Ellis to draw that contact. And that's the fourth foul on Ellis. But not only did he draw the contact, with the left hand, Danny finished the play. Morris doesn't force it. The clock is their hour. Hogue's wide open. You can't do it much better than Iowa State just did it. Iowa State wins it. They hand the Jayhawks their first loss in conference play. And they extend their home court winning streak to 16. They're now, they've now won 47 of their last 49 games here in this building.